Hi guys, Tim here with uh, Tim's Permaculture Homestead. Today I'm out here, and before I go to work, I thought I would uh, uh, start digging up these hazelnut trees. They're they're three, at least three years old. I had them in an air pruning bed, but I think what happened is the roots went down in the ground. Uh, that's why they lived because I didn't water them. Some of the others over there in that air pruning bed. I think some of them died because I just I neglected them, didn't water them. But uh, had a lot of things going on this summer. Anyway, I don't need all of them. I tried to sell them on the marketplace. No, I didn't even get one response. And you know, I mean, I was going to sell, shoot one like that for ten dollars, a smaller one for five bucks. Nobody was interested. They're uh, American hazelnuts. So I'm going to dig them up and I'm going to plant them back here, maybe behind the ponds along the fence line or something. Uh, let the wildlife enjoy them. So that's what I'm going to be doing. Uh, picked some carrots a little while ago. <clears throat> I don't remember what kind they are. I planted three or four different kinds. These done all right. They come out of this bed here. So I'm going to set up my tripod over here and start taking that apart and record it, I guess. And uh, let's get to it. Ouch. Going to, going to get cold, so I want to get this uh, get these trees transplanted before it starts getting real cold out. <clears throat> I'm curious to see how the roots. Okay, I'll get back with you when I get that apart. These are, like I said, hazelnut, uh, American hazelnut bushes. Okay, this has been here about three years, maybe four. Uh, so some of the larger ones, the taproot, come through these this cheap, like felt weed, cla uh, weed cloth, come through and it went in and through this more expensive uh, mesh weed, weed cloth here. So neither one worked from keeping the roots from going down in. Uh, you know, I should have harv I should have dug these up after the first year and transplanted them. This root has gone way down in there. So right here, I'll have to cut that. 
just wanted to see what it looked like underneath and I will be transplanting these uh, I couldn't get that box apart the way I had it made but now I can I can take these bottom cleats cleats off and we'll see what some of the roots like uh, look like when I get that apart hey guys this is a smaller one this is about two foot tall and that's what the root the roots look like on this one uh, I really had to tear the crap out of this to get it out of there unfortunately I'll probably destroy some of them getting the getting some of them out getting them all out uh, excuse me but that's you know what they look like uh, I think I can't I don't have enough time uh, until Sunday to get these out of here and transplant them it'll probably take me quite a bit Sunday to do this so I'm gonna pop that little guy back in there yeah, all right I'm gonna water this real good and that's all I'm gonna do today and I'll do the rest Sunday so I just wanted to show that um, it's always something to do here uh, Sometimes I make more work <laughs> for myself than I need to. But anyway, God bless and have a great week. We'll see you on the next one. Bye.